Hello everyone, welcome to my newest video. That's right, we're finally in Minecraft. We're gonna do a nice Minecraft video, get a tour of my survival world, show you off some stuff. I finally finished this huge project I was working on, so I just decided we're, we're gonna do a tour and then, you know, do some stuff and, and yeah. Um, joining me for today's video, we have Gracie. Say hi, Gracie. <laughs> Some of you probably remember her from the Sonic video teaching Carlos to drive stick. Definitely go check it out. But anyway, let's start off with the tour. Let's get back in the first person. Yes, we do not have a face cam because you do not need to see my face this whole time. And also, you don't need to see my gaming setup. Hashtag rate my gaming setup. And yes, we are also doing mobile gaming because iPad is very convenient. Though we may do some, we might start a new survival series actually on the computer. Uh, stay tuned for that. But anyway, you join me in my first home, actually. So this is underground. It's built into sort of this half ravine cave thing. Spawn is just over that hill there. And uh, I was like, oh crap, we got mobs. So I just dug into this sort of cave thing. And then I just expanded it from there. And it's actually pretty, pretty neat concept. Over here, you can see we have all of my chests organized to perfection because I'm that person. I need my stuff to be organized or else it's just, just give me ACD, ACDC, OCD. Um, <laughs> uh, yeah, we got our furnaces, we got our, our cookers, we got all of our materials over here, which is basically what I use this place for. It's kind of just material collecting. We got our mine over there. Um, uh, we got our tree farm over there. And yeah, that's kind of the interior. Uh, joining me over here, we have my hallway of doom. Basically, these are all the pillagers that keep bugging me and annoying me. But over here, we got a neat pathway, which I worked way too long on. We'll talk about that later. But over here, we have my sheep farms, my, my cow farms, uh, my automatic wheat slash potato farm, because potatoes are the best food. I love potatoes. Uh, we got my tree farm over there. Um, and that giant sky route, which don't look at. We'll, we'll talk about that later. Please don't look at it. Don't look at it. <laughs> Um, but anyway, under this strange looking platform I built a while ago, we have actually my mob farm sort of thing. Originally I had this closed off, we were going to have mobs spawn in here and fall into the water and fall into the hole. And it never worked out, so I just kept it open and Gracie, do not fall in the hole. Yeah. Do not go in there. It is... jeez. Okay. Uh, if you follow me here, you can actually see what happens when they fall into the hole. They get squished. They get squished. I know this is overly complicated. I am not a noob. Please do not call me a noob. Um, I did not have sticky pistons at the time, so I had to devise this sort of complicated system that would uh, squish them and then unsquish them when they're gone uh, because I didn't have sticky pistons at the time. So, yeah, that's sort of my first redstone thing, and actually it's pretty cool. Whenever they fall in there, it activates this redstone, which pushes this block over and activates a, uh, a timer, I guess you call it. it. It causes this redstone to blink, letting me know that something fell in the hole. And over here, every time we walk across that, it resets the timer. Uh, but yeah, every time mobs fall in here, collects their stuff in here. Um, a couple of sheep may have fallen in there, that is not my fault. <laughs> um, but yeah, that's sort of my, my first thing going on over here with my, my, my OG home. I think it looks pretty cool, actually. One of my better builds. Uh, uh, Gracie, where'd you go? <laughs> Uh, over here, we have another automatic thing. It's not very clean right now. I need to organize it, make it better, but we have an automatic melon farm. Check it out. You got melons, you press the button, it squishes them, pushes it over, the water goes away, goes back down, and it grows more. Works pretty well. I didn't have any observers at the time, but I am going to make it fully automated when I get around to updating this place. But as I have mentioned, I've been working a long time on a project, and you'll get to that in a bit. So. Since this is uh, sort of where I started, Gracie has a home here. Why don't you give us a tour of your house, Gracie? It's not fully finished. <laughs> um, there is a secret entrance. Oh boy. Ah yes, the bright birch doors. That's the, the secret. <laughs> <laughs> uh, our, our friend Jace has joined the game. Oh, oh my gosh, Gracie. <laughs> I'm trying to get in your house and it appears she just fell off one of my houses. Um. Never the regardless, let's keep going. <laughs> Never the regardless. That's my new word, I like it. Uh, um, the first thing you might notice when you walk into my house is my aesthetic lighting. The, the deadly pool of lava, one glass block away. <laughs> yes. It with looks my wooden nice. floor. <laughs> <laughs> it's not a safety hazard. No. Okay. Um, Just making sure. I'm still working on the ceiling, as you can see, I'm making it a nice stone. I love the dirt. 
which is amazing. Yes. So, here's my um, storage area. I like your pile of furnaces. Yes. <laughs> and my bed and my night light. The torch is in your head. But anyway, <laughs> nice. I like it. The floor is very nice. Yes. Okay. And as you can see, I have a mine. I wouldn't uh, advise jumping down there because there's no water. Oh. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> That's just dangerous. Yes. You join me upstairs. Oh, you can see um, the floor is still nice to be worked on. Um, but you have a nice view. I of like the, water. the lighting. Yes. Oh, you, you have some leaks. Yes, it's keeping the grass green. <laughs> so we have muddy grass on the inside of here. Yes. I should just put carpet there. <laughs> no. We'll have, Soggy, we'll have, muddy carpet. oh, and I'm gonna walk around in socks. No, oh. wet socks yeah. on muddy grass no, on wet no. carpet. <laughs> oh. uh, unfinished though. All right, so that's Gracie's house. Um, all right, so that's our, our sort of spawn location. Unfinished, as you can see, that creeper is trying to kill us, but. <laughs> Uh, yeah, we got we got some good stuff going on mainly using for uh, resource gathering and I forgot to talk about this guy This is Porkins um, His name is actually Porkins Gracie watch out for the skeleton behind ah! him Again Ye uh, Oh my gosh Ooh, look at that trident thing Oh, thank you It's uh, very expensive I have lots of them <laughs> <laughs> um, But yeah, this is Porkins He was just a pig chilling and during a thunderstorm he was struck by lightning so I decided to uh, capture him and put him here. Uh, pretty rare that that happens. His name's Porkins after the X-Wing pilot from Star Wars. Uh, fantastic character. But uh, yeah, he's always in the water. I guess it feels nice. <laughs> yeah, that's Porkins. So, next location then. We're not going on the Sky, tra sky Rain Trail. Sky Trail? Sky Rail? Sky rail. Squirrel. Squirrel. <laughs> We're not going on the squirrel yet. I should make that a sign. We're actually following this pathway, which took me way too long to make. I spent so much time on this when really all I needed was a bridge. But, oh, Gracie, did you hit your horse again? Oh, God, I hate these Minecraft buttons. Yeah, no, the, uh, the mobile Minecraft buttons can be difficult. Anyway, this is my horse. His name is Doodlekins. I put a poll on Instagram as to what I should name him, and everyone just told me to name him Horse. That is the worst name ever. You guys failed me. So I, I named him Doodlekins because that is much better. Gracie, talk us through your horse. My horse name is Stripes. But why? Yes, <laughs> Stripe Heads. Uh, and yeah, so I got this horse. I'm like, oh my gosh, this is so cool. I got a horse, he's really fast. And then Gracie got this horse and it is just stupid fast. Yep. It's it's like the Conan Seg of horses and I, ha I have the Pontiac Fiero. Like, it's not fair, but my horse is still really cool. Anyway. My horse is polka dotted. Oh yeah, her polka dotted horse's his name is Stripes. Um, <laughs> <but> <laughs> no, no, come back. Uh, my, it's okay. Pontiac Fiero is great. I should have named him Fiero. Anyway. <laughs> Fiero. Never the regardless. Oh, look out for the, the dry boy. Whoa, you just ran over the fence. Yeet. <laughs> uh, this pathway took me way too long, but check out this view, okay? I am no civil engineer, but I think this tower looks pretty dope. All right, this is my... You just blocked my view. Up, oh, drive... No. Okay, he's gonna back that. Drive boy, get out of here. Drive boy. Drive boy. He's so crusty. Um, <laughs> this is my, my enchanting tower, which took me a while to build, but it was my second building. Um... And that's what the pathway leads to. We're great. Oh. I follow the path. Okay. <laughs> oh, no, that picture is cute. Yeah. That's the thumbnail. Uh, okay. <laughs> no, I can't do that. It's the thumbnail. Stinking dry boy. You know, um, so this is my entrance to my enchanting tower. I noticed my nice glass doors. It's just like a supermarket. Friend Jace is now online. But anyway, back to uh, my glass door. We have some other features. It's like, oh my gosh, Grace is here. Quick. Now she cannot get in. It is locked. And if she's really annoying you, you can just go, ha ha. Ah! <laughs> hey. I love that feature. I can just squish any unwanted visitors. Like, ha, nope. <laughs> okay, you can come in now. No. Okay, I'm serious. It's open now. It's open. Oh, Oof. she just fell again. Where <laughs> is she? What is she doing? Who knows? 
Anyway, this is just sort of my opening, I don't know, hall thing. And because ladders make a really annoying noise and who wants to climb up so many ladders, we have an awesome elevator here, all right? This is my first redstone elevator I implemented. It can look a little weird, so watch your eyes, everyone. But, watch uh, your watch your eyes, yeah, I mean... Gee. I'm not gonna watch my eyes. No, watch your eyes, okay? Look at this, it's a little trippy. Um, but I made this in my experiments world, it's my first elevator. Uh, and if you want to see more redstone stuff, definitely let me know and I can show you all my redstone creations in my um, experiments world. If you're... <laughs> I didn't watch my eyes. You, what? Ah! Oh, that was great. Okay. It's all right, though. Watch your eyes coming up this time or else you'll fall down. That is how you get back down, actually. You just yeet yourself down the hole. You got a slime block at the bottom so you can you can live. Um, uh, yeah. And she's coming back up. Do, do, do. Anyway, while we're waiting on Gracie, this is my first floor. You got a nice observation deck here. Lots of glass. You can see down. Actually, my favorite view is over here. You can see uh, that nice waterfall, kind of covered by clouds, but it's just a really nice location. I like it a lot, and it is actually getting a little dark out, so let's wrap this up. <laughs> but you can see, uh, that's our first floor, nice observation. Uh, pretty cool, actually. I fell off this tower so many times when I was building it, but it's totally safe. Uh, totally safe for totally Jace. <laughs> <laughs> even though she keeps falling off somewhere. Oh, can you, can you even stare? <laughs> Gracie hates stairs, that's why I had to build an elevator. This is hysterical. Oh my gosh, that was not hysterical. I am hysterical. <laughs> uh, yeah, so this is my my diamond armor I'm working on right now. I'm trying to get... Get out of the armor, Gracie. Yeah! <laughs> I'm trying to get full level 30 enchanted diamond armor for when we fight the ender dragon, which I have not done yet. Uh, but that is going to be coming relatively soon. Uh, Oh, Jace left. Anyway, so this is my enchanting tower. As I said, we got a nice enchanting room here, and you're probably like, well, where's all the books at? It's okay. I'm a redstone person. See? Boom. You want a little bit of books? You got a little bit of books. It's like, okay, well, I got a bit more levels. I'm like, not a noob. I got some levels. Okay, we got even more books. And it's like, oh my gosh, I'm such a pro. Guess what? Boom. We got all the books. Basically, it means you don't... <laughs> Gracie, watch your eyes, come on. <laughs> Basically, it means you don't need to put torches on all the books because that's always really annoying to do. Instead, we just got piston activation uh, uh, for enchanting. I actually really like it. It works pretty well. Uh, up to my top floor, it is now nighttime. We'll get that scenery. scenery. Uh, totally open. I would not recommend having this in real life because the altitude would probably be real bad for you. Um, but you can actually see my path lit up real nice down there, looking very, very nice. Uh, and there is snow here. I used to have a snow golem, but <laughs> no. I used to have a snow golem. Uh, he was great, but then it rained and he died. I did not realize that was a thing. So R.I.P. Snow Golem, 2018 to 2018. Um, <laughs> oh, <laughs> he, did, he lasted literally like two days. Uh, anyway, so that's my enchanting tower. I think it's pretty cool. Again, I'm really proud of the builds in this place. I'm normally terrible at building stuff, but I think this is looking pretty nice. Yeah, <laughs> this is this is my elevator. And to get down, you just yeet yourself down. And it's like, yeet. Ah! <laughs> Let's head on back. It is dark out, so avoid the dry boys. Oh, here comes the zombie. Where's my lid? Where's your lid? My lid. Oh, he's got a nice hat. Oh, a my nice... horse just went in. He got a nice hat, though. Look at this man's lid. <laughs> His lid. Ow! Grace, did you run into the lid, man? Yes. Okay, well, let's follow the path back. Look at this lighting. It's so majestic. Come, come back here with you, Conan said, of course. Hey, how's it lighting? Uh, I have torches under the slabs. Oh, that's genius. I know, right? It's so good. No, oh, you should have named it Conan Horse. Conan Horse. Come back. Meow. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Oh, that's a creeper. Ooh. Creeper. Oh man. Uh, right. So that's my enchanting tower and my original home. Ah, yes. We got to the smell of burnt monsters. In the so, yes, it is finally time. We get to go in my sky rail, my scrail. Um, scrail. <laughs> uh, and yeah, so we get to ride in the new cyber truck. Gracie Trap, you know, get on in there for upgrading here. Um, <laughs> not really. 
<laughs> so yeah, get to see uh, my sky I've been waiting for this for so long. Gracie has not seen this project that I've been working on forever. I'll let you guys know. It is my uh, railway station, essentially. Uh, and uh, check out my scrail, looking pretty nice. We're in this huge desert. But check out this pretty dope village over here. I've saved them from raiders once, I think. <laughs> And it should be coming into rendering distance soon. Ta-da! Whoa! <laughs> this is my railway station. It is floating because everything floating is cool. Bye. <laughs> uh, yeah, this has taken me so long, and I will proudly say it's probably my best Minecraft build I've done. Pretty nice. Wow. Look at that magma stuff. Oh yeah, these are the rockets holding it up because it can't just be floating. Cool. Uh, thank you, thank you very much. Oh no! Ah! Oh, well. I haven't used it with two people yet. <laughs> it's okay. Uh, yeah, so this is my first floor here. Very luxurious. Um, if you come over here, you can enter my lawn. We'll cover this first. Ta da! We got some. Yeah, they spawned up here. Oh, no. Why would you do that? I was trying to mount him. He spit on you. <laughs> oh, well now you're getting distracted. Don't want it. <laughs> we got some nice fountains here. Uh, they actually spawned up here when I was building. It was such a big area that had so many llamas just spawning in my house. It's pretty annoying. But yeah, we got we got uh, some nice fountains. We got my uh, my, my house here. Oh, we got we got a a, a duck. Chicken. It's a duck. Oh, did you just kill it? No. What? I didn't kill it. Where is it then? It ran away. Yeah, okay, that's what they all say. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> Gracie <laughs> is hashtag Gracie's a duck killer. No, Put it in the comments. Like the chickens in <laughs> just kidding, she so volunteered for animals. Um, this is my train station. So I only have two locations so far. Uh, my OG. Ow. Gracie, I'm trying to press the buttons. <laughs> My OG home, which is where we just were, and I have my nether portal area, which we will be going to soon. But I have room for, I think, six other locations. I don't know, count them, I don't feel like it. Uh, but yeah, whatever button you press, that's where you're going. It'll light up for you, let you know. Um, you can only have one selected at a time, so you don't want any selected. You can hit the reset button, and also this button will summon another minecart. But it does that automatically. Um, if you guys want to see the redstone, actually, we can head on through this secret passageway. If you want a tutorial, please let me know. I will show you guys how all of this works because I am such a Minecraft redstone nerd. That's what I get for being an engineer. But yeah, that's it's actually pretty simple. Uh, it's automatic loading and unloading minecarts and whatnot. But yeah, so that's the first floor, all of this stuff. And sh what should we do? We should do the second floor or the landing pad first? Up or down? Okay, Grace is going down. This is my observation <laughs> room down here. You can see kind of just everything because I always want an Ooh. observation deck. Uh, over here, we have the exit. Make sure you don't move, Gracie. Read the sign. See ya. <laughs> don't move. <laughs> this is how you get down from it. This is how I got to it before I had um, uh, everything built because I didn't have the rails built at first. We got some nice clothes under it. Notice I have lava under the rockets as well because that's cool. Um, but yeah, this is this is my elevator. Elevator 2.0. Pretty cool. Gracie, go on up there so I can show everyone how it looks. Uh, it's almost like you're being Whoa. beamed up, I think. It's pretty neat. It shows up lights sky. every time you go up there. Beam up sky. Can I get no, coffee's disgusting. Coffee. But yeah, this is how you get up and down from it in case you're getting here by horse or by walking or, you know, some other kind of boringness. Uh, Gracie, where'd you go? These chests are just the materials I used to build it. Um, I haven't put them away yet because I literally finished yesterday and we're putting this out video, you know, we're, we're filming it now. If you join me on the second floor, you can see my aquarium. Aquarium? Yeah. Whoa. Um, we did have fish. Oh yeah, there's the fish. They're back there. Uh, but this, oh, yeah, they, here they come. Look, we got some salmon here. Oh. I'm glad they're still alive. <laughs> but yeah, we got some bubbles, we got some kelp, we got some seagrass. This took me a long time to get all the water right, mainly what was holding me up for a while. But I got all of that right. Um, we got another nice bay window over here uh, with some decorative plants looking very nice. <laughs> we walk by my lovely aquarium. You can see actually the glass ceiling 
as well. I had to take down a lot of netherrack to get this roof, but I think it looks pretty nice to live with the netherrack. Over here, we got, you know, glass floor. Again, this would terrify me in real life, but it looks pretty nice in Minecraft. Uh, and over here, we got another fountain because fountains always look nice. We got some books, some lights, some windows. 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 Um, and some, some benches in case you're waiting for the train. Though, of course, that wouldn't happen because, you know, it's my part. Uh, oh, and the sun setting. Look at this nice sunset. Ooh. Over here, we got my sleepy time room. We got oh. some bunks. We got a nice porch over here overlooking the village. That's actually really nice of you. Why are you stealing my stuff? <laughs> There's nothing in there. Well, yeah, but what? <laughs> stop looking through my chest. Yeah, we got a nice view of the village. Check out that sunset. Stop bunks. Okay. bunk. Okay. <laughs> oh, yeah, you do spawn in the upstairs. It's live. Uh, and another room over here I forgot to show. It's just my sort of workstation room. This is where I have all my furnaces, my crafting tables, uh, and all that stuff for building. And we got another nice porch over here. So yeah, that's my train station. This is what has taken me so long to make and, and just delayed me for a while. But I think it came out really well. It's probably my best build. What do you think, Gracie? Yes. Okay. Solid answer from Gracie. This is amazing. Oh, thank you. So without further ado, let's head over to our last destination. I still have to fill up all of these, but uh, let's go. If you look at Gracie's screen, you can see that it will automatically put out another minecart. Uh, you just have to hit the location again, Gracie. Thanks, Alex. Thanks, Alex. So you didn't Never the regardless. I love that word. Yeah, but anyway, so this is my, my squirrel heading over to uh, my final home, my lakefront home, actually. Uh, check out these mountains. But anyway, my OG home is way over there, and I really liked this location, so I built a house over here. But with Doodlekins, the world's slowest horse, it took me so <laughs> daggone long to get from A to B that I built this, this uh, sky rail and built the whole train station for it. Uh, I don't actually have a rail going to my tower yet. Uh, that's just such a pain to get all this glass, but that will probably be coming soon Although it might actually be faster to take the pathway instead of going from my house to the train station to the tower But I'll figure it out. <clears throat> we still have lots of work to do We got a nice dark forest over here, but coming up you'll see the lake on I built this house Pretty dope location. Am I right? I don't know what you're gonna see I'm coming. <laughs> <laughs> uh, But yeah my my sweet little house over here. Look how small it is. So tiny. There we go. Arrived at my destination. Uh, but while we're waiting on Gracie, I'll just show you off this little house here. Lakefront on the cliff. It's pretty cool. Uh, yeah, it is pretty much directly on the cliff. Uh, second floor up here. We got my bed. We got this nice porch during the sunset. Maybe we can catch a sunset here because it looks so cool setting over the water. Uh, really neat. Are you here yet, Gracie? Nope. Oh, there you are. I see you coming down the hill. <laughs> uh, just park your minecart next to mine. Your cyber truck. Yoink! <laughs> oh. All right. My, my humble house. I was just showing off all the uh, locations, but you may notice, that's right, we got another elevator. Let's go. Oh, yes. It would be too easy just to have that little room, oh, so we built this. This is my, I'm not sure what to call it, but it's pretty cool. It's built into the mountain. We got this huge bay window uh, looking real nice. Up here, we got some more beds in case we need them. Another porch because really, you know, porches are awesome. And there's my house up there. So it may look like a little house, but actually we've got a lot going on over here. Uh, this is my brewing stand. We got some of my uh, water bottles over here. Um, Gracie, where'd you go? Mm -hmm. my, we got my water bottles over there. We got my uh, my my nether materials over there. Uh, no, it's not. It's not a hydro flask. Uh, but yeah, because you all know me by now, we cannot just have a normal house. Uh, we got some redstone incorporated in here. Uh, this is my elevator 2.0. It's a lot smoother. It's got double the pistons. Why don't you demonstrate it for us there, Gracie? You gotta stand in the middle. 
and it just pushes you up. It's a lot smoother than my other one, which is just one piston. And it pushes you over. Come back. <laughs> Gracie, come back. Oh. <laughs> Yeet. All right. Uh, my other epic creation over here is this. Okay, so you, some of you probably saw this bridge. You're like, how are you supposed to get there? We got just solid glass. So I made this glass real flush, tune in real good with my giant bay window. But if we hit this button here, check it out. Mm. That drops down. This opens up. Gracie, it's not open yet. <laughs> and it pulls blows both blocks open. You have a fully open glass door. <laughs> Fully open glass door now to lead you over to across the other pathway. Now Gracie's out there, so we can actually lock her out real quick. Oh, wait. <laughs> oh. But yeah, the light indicates close or open. You hit the open button, and let's just watch that open again because it's so cool. Takes a bit to open, but I think that works really well. I'm uh, I'm real proud of that. Uh, and yeah, so it comes across, opens this door up as well. Um, you can open and close them from over here. Uh, oh, darn, Gracie got in. Uh, hey! <laughs> but this is inside the other uh, mountain, sort of on the lake here. You can see where... This nice lake. Oh yeah, no, that's gonna look so nice. But uh, check this out. So this was actually a cave already in this, uh, this place. So I built a nice glass ceiling to show that off. The whole mountain was actually kind of hollow. And so that's pretty neat. Look at that sunset. So good. And over here, inside this locked gate, we have the nether portal. Alright, I think this looks pretty cool. Uh, we got the nether rack, we got the lava, wow. and our, our nether portal here. Not too fancy, but I think it looks pretty cool. Crazy! Oh! <laughs> Jump in the water! Um, oh yeah, well Gracie's just gonna spoil our next well, part. Oh, there's a llama. <laughs> Why is there a llama down there? <laughs> anyway, I don't really have anything in the nether, so I'm not gonna show you that guy. Guys, that, that is my next project. Actually, I want to get a whole XP farm going on in there. But that's the uh, portal room. If you come down here, down our steps where Gracie already spoiled it. So, oh! <laughs> yeah, there's a llama! We have my dock uh, that goes out into the lake. This is actually where I got all my salmon from my fish tank. But uh, we also have a llama in a boat, and Gracie in a in a llama in a boat. <laughs> what, what are you doing? Uh, but yeah, so that's my my last location, I'd say. Uh, if you follow me this way, actually, we do have a bit more to show you guys. Whoa! What are you doing? Turbo, 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 Gracie. I love that door. Overcomplicated, yes, but awesome, yes. Oh, Gracie! <laughs> Why would you do that? I didn't mean to! So mean! Oh my gosh. Uh, it's my house now! Pushing me off my own bridge. Ugh. I can't- I can't believe you've done this. Anyway, so, I'm sure all of you nerds out there want to see how this stuff works. Or not, but I'm going to show you anyway. Notice this secret passageway. Check that out. <laughs> Gracie, get out of the way. <laughs> Over here, notice this is just totally plain wall. Uh, we have a secret passageway to the redstone. Oh! This is probably my most uh, redstone concentrated area ever. Uh, so this yeah. redstone is just for the door here. Oh. Yeah, that's how you get out in case you lock the door like that. Oh. Oh wait, no. This locks the door. Ow! Sorry, that locks the door. I lock the door. Now we're inside. Whoa. Oh, I get it. <laughs> this is my redstone for the elevator here. Uh, pretty simple. Again, if you want to actually see how to build any of this or whatever, I have a whole world where I do nothing but redstone and creative, and I can definitely show that off to you guys. Uh, if you come down this passageway, you can see the redstone for that dope door I have. Oh it's um, a little complicated. <laughs> uh, this took me a while to get to work, but in theory, it's very simple. Basically, you just have the redstone up here connected to each different piston, and then this goes on a loop from back to forth, activating each torch as to which piston needs to be activated when. Um, and again, there are tons of caves around here, so this redstone is actually built into a cave around my house. I opened it up. Gracie is already exploring. <laughs> um, this cave just goes around, actually. Hey. No, don't! Ow! Why'd you do that? <laughs> Why is there a hole? Because 
That's where the cave was. I don't know. I have a fence here, and you went around the <laughs> fence down the hole. I'm showing off the rest of the cave. Check this out. You can have this little opening where you can see my bridge and my house and stuff. Pretty neat. Um, but anyway, back into the redstone. Uh, this is not all of it. This is just for the one door on this side. That's how it opens uh, from one side. It's four block opening. Down here, we have the redstone that hooks it up to the another door. The other door. So this goes under the water and then up around the mountain um, and hooks up to the other door and the buttons over there. So it's all synchronized. It's all hooked together. And it all works really well, actually. I think it came out pretty nice. Oh, thank you. Uh, so yeah, that is my last destination. Um, <laughs> Gracie, where are you going? I don't know where I am. Don't get lost in the redstone. Don't gotta, can't get lost in the salt. So that's it for today's video, guys. I hope you enjoyed. Uh, let me know if you want to see some more Minecraft content, some more survival stuff from me and Gracie, or some of my redstone creations and tutorials. But that's about it for today. Uh, thanks for watching, everybody. See you later.